From high tech to the high concept of Invivo wines, Rob Cameron and Tim Lightbourne have known each other for 22 years. They came up with the concept of Invivo at a pub in London. Now, in 2012, they export their product to 13 countries. In the old school world of wine, Invivo are a new breed of winemaker. They are reinventing the core ideas behind what it means to be a winery. I'm Rob uh, Cameron, uh, winemaker, co-founder of Invivo Wines. And we're here in uh, my lovely cellar, uh, where we make all our Pinot Noir and our small handmade batches of, of wines for Invivo. Yeah, Invivo means in life. It comes from the Latin uh, word, uh, Viva, and uh, that's sort of something we wanted to really sort of get across in our brand, that wine's about enjoyment, it's about having fun in your life, it's about sharing with your friends and family, and taking some of that sort of old world European uh, sort of wine uh, integration into society and sort of bring that into our brand in a really sort of fun and innovative way. Uh, and then we started to launch in Vivo, we didn't, you know, this sort of recession came, um, you know, the banks was quite tough at that time. Uh, and also uh, there was a lot of wine produced in that year in 2008 so it was a sort of a perfect storm for us to head straight into. Um, but what I would say is it taught, a, taught us a lot and I think we sort of improved by being quite prudent. With Invivo we, we knew pretty quickly that we had to be pretty flexible, pretty dynamic, you know, make wines that people wanted to drink. You know, we are working for our customers. You know, I'm responding to what they say. And when we're out in the market tasting with them, you know, we're listening, you know, do you like that aspect of our wines or don't you like that aspect of our wines? And then each year, we're sort of going back to the drawing board and saying, okay, well, people like that style or they didn't, let's change it. You know, does this market like this style? Does that market like that style? So, you know, it's really about being adaptable, flexible, and making what people want to drink. You know, two years ago, for example, we um, launched uh, a low-calorie, lower alcohol Sauvignon Blanc and uh, called Bell by Invivo, and um, we literally can't make enough of that stuff. It's, uh, it's just flying out the door. Uh, and that was uh, New Zealand's first ever wine to put a nutritional panel on the back. We actually nicknamed it Cougar Juice, so, uh, yeah, it's, it's been a positive... Uh, positive wine. Obviously I'm now in 13 countries in the world, but uh, you know, it's always good to come back to the local. The club Mangawai, Alden Club, one of our first uh, stockists and uh, still a good customer. Cheers. Cheers, mate. Cheers. Cheers.